They're just a part of our lives, those screens these days. And a new study looks at how children's minds are affected by time looking at screens. NBC 26's Brooke Haves spoke with a Green Bay family and dives deeper into the early findings of that study. The federal government is investing $300 million into the Adolescent Brain Cognitive Development, or ABCD, study. And it will follow nearly 12,000 healthy children between the ages of 9 and 10 into early adulthood and give a closer look at how screen media activity affects the minds of our youth. Okay, it's been an hour of video games. We're done now. The Millers limit screen time for their four children. During the winter months, we definitely kind of have to make a strategic, concentrated effort to be like, okay, it's enough. It's time to go do something else. This family sets rules because of evidence found in studies such as the ABCD study. Data released from the study in February of 2018 shows significant differences in the brains of children who engage in screen media activity for more than seven hours a day. Although experts say it is still too early to explain exactly why. Doctors with Aurora Baycare say children's brains grow actively until at least age 25. So it is important for them to engage in activities other than screen time. The physical part of doing projects like block building and building things use a whole different part of your brain and a whole different skill set which they need for the rest of their life and so screen time just robs them of that experience. Guidelines set by the American Academy of Pediatrics say children younger than 18 months should avoid the use of screen time. Ages 2 to 5 limit screen use to one hour per day and 6 and older place consistent limits and make sure it doesn't impact adequate sleep, physical activity and other essential healthy behavior. Engage with peers and go out and do stuff, go out to dinner, um, talk with your family, and that's going to just naturally grow, grow your brain the way it's supposed to. Good job. For the Millers, that means no more than one hour of screen time per day. To bring a book along, and you have to bring something along to go outside and play with. <laughs> The ABCD study will follow the participants for 10 years. So far, the baseline data gives us just a glimpse into what the NIH hopes to learn about the effects of screen time on our children's brains. Brooke Hafes, NBC26.